Well, hello, everybody. Thank you for joining us for what we hope will be an intriguing group stage game. And it is first against second. Two teams with the same objective, and that is to make sure that they will still be here once the competition resumes under a different format, one that is far less forgiving than now. This, no doubt, a game of the utmost importance, not so much for the final outcome in this group, but potentially who meets whom when that time comes around. And that is something that both of these sides are only too well aware of, with those finishing top getting what is usually a more comfortable draw. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. Inter Milan have gone 4 3 3. Jim, how do you interpret that? Yeah, and the two wide players up front can make the system pretty much succeed or fail. They'll be quite flexible in their creative movement. They like to drift in. At times, they'll mix their game up and, and keep their width. And, of course, they're also expected to track any runs from opposition fullbacks. So they've got quite hard-working jobs. But if they can gain a one-on-one -on -one advantage, they can dictate. And that gets things running. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Ankel Di Maria. He's someone who rarely fails to make a big impression. He's such a silky, elusive dribbler and a fine finisher with the knack of scoring some spectacular goals. He's a player that this team will want to have on the ball as often as they can. He's a great creator. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. Up towards the front line, just brushed off the ball there. Plays it over to the other flank. And it's played forward. João Mario. Di Maria. And it's Mario. Gets wrestled off the ball. João Hanolu. Little doubt, that is a foul. He gets the ticking off and needs to be very careful now. Yeah, and he has to change his ways or this referee could soon change his status. Rafa Silva battles to win it back. Benfica are playing with a pleasing width here, especially that front line. Is it working for you? Um, it's not movement for the sake of it, and yes, it is working for me. There's a purpose to, to create space. Cuts it out. <laughs> the other side, especially adventurous early on. Forward it goes. Keeper sends it forward. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. João Mario. Martinez. João Hanolu. Martinez. A wonderful effort all by himself. I just hope he won't let the failure to score affect him. With the ability he has, he can reproduce. And he 
He's there to clear it. Hits one! Di Maria tries to switch the play. That has put a stop to that. Now Mario. Still goalless. Otamendi goes looking. Tries to get it forward quickly. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Stefan de Vrij. To throw. And it's Chalhanolu. Plays it out to the wing. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Stefan de Vrij. Hoists it forward. Well positioned to make that interception. Otamendi. The goal now would certainly liven things up. Tries to get it forward quickly. Rafa Silva. And that's a throw in. Ball needed to be better there, that's a wasted chance. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. He's gone for a throw in. Out to the left it goes. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's played forward. Arnautovic conjuring up some magic on the right-hand side. Letamendi gets it back. Oh, he's taken out, that'll be a foul. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. A really close shave and the last action of the first half. So both sides have drawn blanks and have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Do it back on the first 45 minutes. Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil-nil. Well, the action has already resumed here. So deadlock still as the second half begins. Chelhanolu. And here's Arnautovic. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Arnautovic really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Rafa Silva tries to stroke it through. He's in space and looking for options. Turns and goes back. It's a great ball. Di Maria plays it out to the flank. 
Delivers across. It's a brilliant interception. Brings it forward. Arnautovic. He's left it. And Arnautovic! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Great leap! Just off target. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Played out to the right. Looking cross-field, changing the point of attack. Just brushed off the ball there. Hoists it forward. All the way back, and they start again. Now Mario. It is still anyone's game. Nil-nil. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Jao Mario. Out to the right. Now it's Di Maria. And it's Di Maria. One straight back has a pop. Forward it goes. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Tries to get it forward quickly. Hoists it forward. Rafa Silva. And it's played forward. Benfica are enjoying lots of possession, but they just can't find any penetration. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Clear away. Inter showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Battles to win it back. Jean Mario. Over to the left. Good challenge, he just stood firm. It's intriguingly poised for me, and players are thinking, well, should we stay or, or should we go? I'd like to think fortune favours the brave, and I'm urging them to, to be bold and go for it. Gets the better of his man. Looks to thread it through. Gets it back. It's a loose ball. He's looking to get there first. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Gel Mario. And it's Di Maria. So that's it, it is all over. Well, a frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defences broadly in charge.